morning so let's talk bolstering under the knees which you often um, is in, uh, you're encouraged to do whilst you're um, in a relaxation pose um, the trouble with bolstering under the knees is it's just holding you and supporting you in um, a posture that creates low back pain so if you see if I lay down here with my knees bolstered which is very similar to a sitting position or a standing position with your weight onto your toes your whole back line of muscles are stay shortened your um, pelvis is um, tilted backwards and you'll feel that that it's pushing your lower back into the floor and you'll feel your ribs are pushing up into the sky which means that you're shortening your psoas muscle um, and creating even more back pain even though you're trying to release that back pain and stay relaxed because you're also bolstered in this position it makes breathing a lot harder because your um, your chest cavity is restricting your lungs from really taking a deep breath um, and it's just um, can be quite uncomfortable and, and quite difficult to stay here in a relaxed position for very long so instead what you need to do is bolster your head to encourage your psoas muscle to relax your psoas muscle runs from your bottom rib all the way down your back across your um, pelvis and attaches onto your femurs which is why when you're in a bring your knees up you tend to be almost in a curled position so instead bolster yourself from the middle of your shoulders um, here I haven't got anything with me but also bolster your head you don't want your head to be back because that again can you see your ribs are um, pushing up into the sky which is just going to exacerbate the back pain so you want to bolster your head so your chin is um, kind of tucking in a little bit and you don't want and you want to leave space here to allow that psoas muscle to be able to relax you'll know when that's relaxing because your ribs will start dropping towards the floor if you're getting a little bit of low back pain lift up your back tilt your pelvis forward so your pubic bone is higher towards the ground uh, and then you can be relaxed if you find your arms are uncomfortable here you might want to pop some pillows underneath your arms just to hold them up because you'll find you've got some tightness across the chest from um, a tight psoas and always being in this position so some bolstering under your arms will also really help you get into a relaxed position so i really recommend this if you're doing a relaxation at the end of yoga um, or meditation or anything this is really the best position to get into as it's going to allow your body to relax and rest.